assalamu alaikum everyone i hope all of you are doing well so in this video i will be discussing about karl marx and his views on human nature and society so let's start so who was karl marx so karl marx was born on 5th may 1818 he was a german philosopher economist historian sociologist political theorist journalist and socialist revolutionary he studied law and philosophy at the university of bonn and berlin due to his political publications marx became stateless and lived in exile with his wife and children in london for decades where he continued to develop his thoughts in collaboration with german thinker friedrich engels his best known titles are the 1848 pamphlet the communist manifesto he died on 14 march 1883 So what are the views of Karl Marx on human society and human nature? So his first view is that society as an interrelated whole. Marx views human society as an interrelated whole, the social groups, institution, beliefs and doctrine within it are integrally related. Therefore he has studied their interrelations rather than treating them separately. His second view is that changeable nature of society Marx views human society as inherently mutable in which changes are produced largely by internal contradictions and conflicts such changes if observed in a large number of instances according to Marx show a sufficient degree of regularity to allow the formulation of general statement about their causes and consequences both these assumption related to human society So the third view point of Karl Marx is that human nature and social relationship there is one another uh, one other basic assumption behind historical materialism without which the theory cannot be held together this relates to the concept of man in general according to Marx there is no permanent persistence of human nature human nature is neither originally evil or nor originally good it is in originally potential if human nature is what human beings make history with then at the same time it is human nature which they make and human nature is potentially revolutionary human will be will be not a passive a passive reflection of events but contains the power to rebel against circumstances in the prevailing limitation of human nature It is not that people produce out of material greed or the greed to accumulate wealth but the act of producing the essentials of life engages people into a social relationships that may be independent of their wills in most of human history according to Karl Marx these relationships are class relationships that create class struggle so basically in this video we discuss about the introduction of karl marx his personal life as well as his views on human society and human nature that are the three views that we discussed already if you have any queries you can ask me in the comment section please like subscribe and share my channel thank you for watching